<laughs> Praise God. Well, it's Monday. I trust you had a great uh, weekend and um, good time with the Father's Day and all of that. It was a great time. We just appreciate each of you. You yes. know, we have a strong congregation of men, Marsha. Yes, I'm we do. So blessed we uh, are by that. Blessed. And, uh, and they love God. They love God. Yes, yes, they do. They you do. know, and you see that uh, in their lives. You see that in the way they live and the way they respond. You know, I'm just really uh, tremendously blessed is, by that. Got a purpose for uh, Faith in Back Church yes. here. Well, you know, um, we, we love the ladies. We appreciate them very, very much. But I believe. Uh, men bring a strength to a congregation. Yes, you God know, means for that. Just like a family. It's you know, like just leadership like and so forth. But you know, with women, uh, they make it a lot prettier. They do. Oh, Lord, yes. Uh, you know, <laughs> way prettier on that. So, amen. <laughs> Well, let's uh, let's get on with the devotion. I think that's oh, what we're yeah, here for today. Yeah. Okay, this is yeah, Monday, we... and so we are blessed. And so uh, the the uh, title of our devotion today is "Moving Forward," or um, I put this slowly slipping back. That's okay? right. Mm -hmm. and I'm going to give you some scriptures. Hebrews two one. This is why it is so crucial that we all be all the more engaged and attentive to the truths that we have heard so that we do not drift off course. That's the uh, Passion Translation. Mm -hmm. Or the, the NLT says, so we must listen carefully to the truth we have heard or we may drift away from it. Interesting, Marcia, it is the word drift there. Okay, yes. it's not the word falling off. No, it is the like word all drift. All of a sudden, it's, yes, it's drifting. Yes. Rem I remember a time we were pastoring in Iowa and you were coming to uh, Tulsa and you and, Ray and Aaron were driving and you drifted off to sleep. That's right. You drifted off the road because you heard the bump, 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 you know. Yes, it was and, quite, yeah. quite scary. But it wasn't something that just happened in no, a moment. No, it wasn't okay. like someone pulled out in front of yeah. me and I had to throw my brakes. And I think that's what we have to understand about our spiritual life. If we drift away from God, it's... Uh, or if we fall away from God, it's not something that happens overnight. No, it not. happens a little bit by little bit by little bit. Yeah. You know, it's choices we, we make. Right, we, we, just... we, we quit coming to church to hear the word. Right. We, oh, we quit being involved this, in the... Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, man. summer. Absolutely. We, let's stay home. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'll work out in the yard today. I'll be close to you, God, yeah. out in the yeah, yard. Yeah, yeah. And, and uh, well, it's my only day to really rest, yeah. you know. Yeah. Right. Force okay. That sure. Poor by yeah. Poor, yeah. You know. Man, and, and, you know, this is not something that we all have an ex uh, experience before in our life. Oh, yeah. We all experience that. You know, we, we press forward, you know. We kind of hit you the You can even be cruise. at church and drift away, Charles. Yeah. Mm. How's you, that? Because you're not studying the Word. You're not really uh, engaged. engaged in mm -hmm. the Word when it's being preached or in the worship services. You can drift away. Just it, it's your attitude of heart Okay. a, a lot of times. Uh, I'm, I'm reminded of the Scripture over in Hebrews 6. And it, and it talks about uh, that by, by faith, you know, and he says, and, uh, and, and that he is a rewarder of those who diligently seek him. Amen. That's someone who's paying attention to their spiritual life. I'm going to ask you, are you paying attention to your spiritual life? Ha has your prayer life slipped? You know, I mean, man, you got so many things going. You just don't have time to pray. How about your uh, your devotion in the morning? Your Bible study have has it slipped, or whenever you do it, whether it's morning or evening or when, I don't care. You know, but are you in the Word? Because as these, in, how about your coming to church? You know, I mean, well, you know, well, it's so we many, need to be at church. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we need to hear it when, and we need to be serving God. You yeah. know. Uh, it's like all of a sudden, I just want to come in, hear the word, and leave, you know? Yeah. And God God wants us to use the word. It doesn't say that um, uh, by great knowledge, it is by faith. Not by knowledge, it is by faith. And we know that faith cometh by hearing, hearing by the word of God. But it isn't just how much knowledge you know. Amen. Well, you can have knowledge, but what are you doing with that knowledge? That knowledge will not keep you from drifting away. No. What you do with the knowledge will keep you from drifting. The experiences you have in Christ, the uh, laying hands on people, the things you do for God is what's going to keep you close to him. Yeah. You know, Marsha, I guess I've really noticed, I noticed it this past summer, how um, how Sundays, you know, it, it's the church is slipping even. The church is even slipping. You know, um, we, 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 
you know, we have people come on Wednesday night, but we don't have the crowds on Wednesday night that we have on Sunday mornings, you know. And it's not because it's dark outside now, because it's light outside. Yeah, it's light know? when you come. Yeah, it's light when you, light when you go, you know. So so we, we think, okay, what what is causing that, you know. And little by little, it's like, uh, it's like I, this. I think this past summer, I realized for the first time how little Sunday means in a lot of people's lives. Well, it, and, and I don't think... The situation we've been in in the p- pandemic for the last has three, three years has yeah. helped any. But you know what? Just it's a choice. What are we going to do about it? Are Amen. you going to slip? Are you going to move forward for yeah. God? We're going to keep moving faith to faith, right? That's We're right. going to keep moving That's from right. faith to faith. Amen. That's right. God bless you. We love you. Have a blessed day today.